Welcome to Dodger Stadium. We bring you Friday baseball on the show. It's the New York Mets taking on the Los Angeles Dodgers with my partner Chris. Just about ready to roll. Yeah, the right-hander with the good curveball, Tyler Glass now. Well, last year, kind of around the league average in terms of ERA. And you know what? That's why you have five different looks. There's one, and that's two. One run on. One gone runner at first. Here's the center fielder, James Outman. And the right hander deals. On the ground at first, could be two. The throw is wild and it gets away. And he'll pull him to second safely. And he's going to make it up to second base as that's a two base error. No outs, runner at first. And now it's the polar bear, Pete Alonso. This guy with light tower power. Fouled off. He was late. Glass now back to work. The old one. Nice stop from his backside. There's one. Plenty of time at first. That's a double play. Well, after that, we thought that was going to be a single, not a double play. Just a great job. Dives, knocks it down, feeds it to the second baseman. A nice turn around the bag. Really good job by the way. Here comes Freddie Freeman up to hit. And the pitch. To first, maybe a two ball. Lindor, that's one. And it's a double play to end the inning. One hit in the inning, a solo homer. We're through six full. It's the Dodgers six and the Mets one. Man at first. Here's Pete Alonso. Foul ball there. Well, these Mets just lacking discipline at the plate in this ball game. Chasing pitches has been a big part of the story. We've seen it quite a bit today. It's been tough for them to make contact no at times. And it just doesn't look like they're seeing it very well as a group. Glass now. Ready to deals. This to center field. Outman in position. Hauls it in for the out. And there's one away. And on the mound, you know confidence has to be pretty high now with bad. all of the swings the and misses. Ball. He's had him eaten at now So bad. up next, the Pete Alonso. Mm. Outfield playing very oh, deep, oh, oh, not oh. wanting anything over their heads. And first offering is fouled off. Two down, nobody on. They're Aye. down to their final strike. Love to see it. Power oh, versus power count. right there. The Mets down to their final strike. Oh. Gonna count one and two. Well, he missed badly with that 0-2 fastball. Hitter has to understand. Probably wants to try to put him away with that pitch. So got to stay ready for it. One, two. Liner and oh, that got him. And that'll do it. Well, they win the opener at home. First game of the three-game series. And there's just such a good feeling when you're in your own ballpark. You're sleeping in your own bed. You're eating your clubhouse manager's food. Everything's right in your world. And they played like it today. 6-1 is your final here today. Dave Roberts and company celebrate in the dugout. Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Schaub. Thanks for joining us.
Coming to you live from Southern California. Saturday baseball on the show. It's the New York Mets taking on the Los Angeles Dodgers. Just about set to go. And our pitcher tonight, Bobby Miller. Power pitcher. He's going to speed you up with the fastball velocity. And out of his hand will explode the breaking ball. Very difficult for hitters to keep that front side closed and hit the ball the other way because they know if they're not ready to pull the trigger, the fastball will beat them. Hard ground ball, base now. McNeil headed home. Oh, the throw is wild. Always feels good when you come through and get your team on the board first. I know that was a ground ball, but it was absolutely hammered through the infield. That's not one you're excited to get in front of if you're an infielder. You know they used to say, charge it. Crazy. Two outs, runner at first. Francisco Lindor comes up to the plate. The high heat, too much on that one. Here's Pete Alonso. Singled and drove in a run his first time through. Roll the short, could be two. The flip, there's one. On to Freddy. Double play. Got what he was looking for on the mound right there, and his infielders took care of it. Man at first with one gone. Here's Teoscar Hernandez. It's softly on the ground, left side. Goes to second. Safe there. Safe at first as they can't make the play. Runner at first with two away. Here's some real power at the plate. Pete Alonzo. Bounce to third. Muncy. Sends it to first. And that will end the inning. No runs. Pete Alonzo up now for the Mets. One for three. A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. Oh, yeah. Cold night tonight, Boog, and that's a pretty fun fastball right there. I tell you what, memories of getting jammed, they creeping yeah. into my mind right now. Swing oh, and a miss, and that one missed by a ton. Got to be careful here. This is the type of hitter that can punish you, even with pitches outside the zone. Rip to short. Whips it to oh. first, and that takes care of Alonzo. Out the So they get three. Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. Today, the finale of this three-game weekend set, it's the New York Mets taking on the Los Angeles Dodgers. John Chomby, Chris Singleton with you. So the Los Angeles... Second inning, set to go. And now it's the polar bear, Pete Alonso. With the right hander back to work. Down the left field line, could be extra bases. Makes the turn and heads for second. The throw in. Safe at second. Man, he just absolutely turned on that one. Ripped it down the line. Nice job of staying in the mechanics. Francisco Lindor to the plate now. Fans love him, but he's pretty popular with the players, too. He certainly is, Boog. A player survey on MLB.com listed him as one of the friendliest infielders to chat with during a game. I'm sure he appreciates the recognition from his peers. Hernandez makes the catch, and there's one gone.
And next for the Mets, Francisco Alvarez. Francisco Alvarez. Righty delivers, and that's ball four. Now oh, a great back and forth, and that at bat. He had to play off some really close pitches, and somehow Boogie found a way to keep the bat on his shoulder right there. I'll tell you right now, I couldn't have done it. He goes down looking. Oh, nice job right there. He struck him out twice. The pitch before looked like it was strike three. Doesn't get the call. Bears down. Throws another quality pitch for the strikeout. That one to first. Freeman. He takes it himself to the bag, and that'll do it. Two left for the Mets. They Here's Pete Alonso. Doubled his first time up. Here's a fun oh, no. fact. Dodger Stadium was also the home of the Los Angeles Angels for four years in the 1960s while they waited for Anaheim Stadium to be built. When the Angels were playing games at home, instead of Dodger Stadium, they called it Chavez Ravine Stadium. 2-0 to Cal. Here it comes. Wouldn't chase that time. And there's That's ball, ball four. Take your base. It's tough after falling behind a hitter, two balls and no strikes, but now at least he gets a fresh start against a new batter, but he needs to get back into the strike zone and start pitching with conviction. Up the middle, and it's through for a hit. They fired in quickly, so it's first and second with only one away. Well, we don't think that pitch would have been called a strike, but... He did such a nice job of pulling his hands tight to the body and just getting enough of the barrel on it to be hard enough back up the middle for a knock. And there's a base hit to left. Coming home. Here's the throw to the plate. He's safe. Oh, he's safe. Picks himself up in RBI. Got the top of the ball a little bit, but not much. That was hit pretty hard through the infield, so I think he'd be happy with that swing. Definitely generated some good bat speed. So two down. So up next for New York, Pete Alonso. Strike ah. one. Good pitch right there. No Anytime you can get Let's one strike. by a bat of this caliber, especially with runners on, it's got to give you some confidence out there on the mound that you can win this battle. This to third, Muncie. Zips it to first, and that is that. That's leave one. One out, base is empty. Pete Alonso getting ready to hit. One for two. Alonso. And that one hit 97 on the gun. Got to keep things airtight defensively right here. On your toes, ready to make a play. If you can get this to the ninth with a three-run lead, it should be a W. At the belt and fires. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. Still able to get it there in time. And they come away with an out after a tricky start to the play. Just a great effort all the way around at third base right there. Nice job to get a glove on it with the dive. For a really nice three-game home series sweep. They came out and you know, from the first game of this series, really had a determination to play fundamentally sound baseball. They came up with the big hit when they needed it. Pitchers came in, they got the big outs when they needed it. So all the way around, a uh, collective effort that has produced a nice little...